guys, welcome to another video on the Garden State Koi YouTube channel. Now if you found your way to this video, it's likely that you're either looking to do some maintenance on an existing water feature, or you're looking to start an entirely new water feature project, in which case, congratulations. The initial planning phase and communicating with us about the scope of the project and what you need can be drastically expedited and made a heck of a lot easier by following these simple rules on how to send us photos for your upcoming project. All right, so let's talk about maintenance jobs first. So the most important thing we need to understand initially is the size and shape of your feature. If you're sending a photo of a pond, we need to see the entire pond. So all the edges should clearly be in view. The most important takeaway here should be to zoom out. We can always zoom in on a photo that you send us, but we can't zoom back out. So make sure everything we need to see is clearly in view. A great idea to help us get a sense of scale is to include objects in the background. For example, these chairs give us a good sense of how large this pond is. So once you have a good photo of the entire water feature, you can get some photos of important details that we need to know about. Clear, close-up shots of your filtration, shots that show how clear or dirty the water is, shots that show how your plants are doing, and any other problem areas or red flags, quote unquote, that you feel that we should know about. Also, shots of the waterfall, any fountains, and any other decorative features are super helpful. Okay, now let's move on to installation. We need to have a clear understanding of the canvas that we're working with before we can begin, so sending us a clear photo of the area that properly conveys the environment is key. Once again, make sure you are zoomed out enough so that we can get an idea of not only the spot that you want to put your feature, but of the surrounding area. We need to have a good idea of what sort of obstacles that we'll need to work around, like electrical equipment, walkways, trees, and where we'll be able to get access to the area for machinery, and so on. We'll also need to get a good idea of the grade that we'll be building on. Taking a picture lower to the ground will let us see if the area slopes downward or upward, and will give us a better idea of what we need to make the project happen. Now, if you'd like, it would also be super helpful if you found any ideas for inspiration, some examples of other projects that you'd like to incorporate ideas from, and so on. You can even check out some of the other videos on our channel. We have tons of installation videos that show the start to finish process of creating a water feature. So feel free to watch some of those and let us know if you have any ideas from them. Now for any type of project, sending us at least three to 10 photos would be extremely helpful and would make the process a lot easier. So that's really all you need to know for sending us photos to start off your project. Thank you so much for watching, we really appreciate it. If you like what you saw and if it was helpful, drop a like, drop a comment, and make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any of our videos.